Alright everyone, welcome to my small video explaining a little bit about the throttle detent that we have currently in the C-130J. I know the developers are aware that we would like a just a button detent to be able to go throttle down, press the button, and then be able to go throttle up into reverse. But that is not an option right now, so this is what I've been using. Hopefully this helps some people with their throttle detents and not accidentally going into reverse. So first, you'll want to adjust your controls and find these two, ground range disable and ground range enable. Bound that to either a two-way switch or two separate buttons and remember which two these are. All right, so we're on the ground right now. Parking brake is on. Right now, I have the ground detent disabled so that when my throttle, my physical throttle that my hand is on, is all the way down, I stop at flight idle. Pushing the detent enable button will now allow us to go into reverse full when the throttle is all the way down. <clears throat> Moving back to flight idle, we can then disable the ground detent and bring the throttle all the way back down to the bottom position. This will stop it in flight idle. Again, bring your throttles in the C-130 just past flight idle and then enable your reverse detent. If you just barely touch your throttle, you'll notice it will switch and go down into full beta reverse when the physical throttle that you have your hand on is all the way down. This gives you full range between everything. So this would be good for on the ground only. While you're taking off, I recommend that you switch the detent enable or disable, excuse me, while you're taking off. That way you don't accidentally go back into ground idle. That's pretty much it. That's how I use it. Uh, during landing, I will actually, on approach, enable my ground detent and monitor my engine diagnostics on landing. That way, when I have wheels down and I'm below 100 knots, I can just toss that throttle back and give myself some reverse thrust. Hope this helps you guys in understanding how this detent works for a single physical throttle that does not have a magnetic detent on the lower end to stop you from feeling where you go <clears throat> into ground idle. If you have any other questions, you're more than welcome to direct message me or uh, you know, ask questions in the uh, ASC Discord. Alright, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and happy flying.